Managers in the Ministry of Agriculture, Water and Land Reform are in Swakop Mund to craft a new strategic plan. Schletwein says these intended interventions will directly impact the lives of Namibians and must be informed by priority, relevance and a targeted approach. Of the past 30 years, and five years after the equally historic Second National Land Conference and its consequent resolutions, tens of thousands of Namibia continue to yearn for access to productive land. At the same time, overall productivity of large swathes of resettled land portions is concerning and far too low. Despite challenges, the minister also highlighted the main achievements from the current strategic plan, which include improvement in access to potable water. The percentage of households with access to improved sanitation facilities improved from 42% in 2016-17 to now 54% over the past five years. The construction of Nekatal Dam, our largest dam, and eight other earth dams was completed enabling opportunities for intensive agriculture and enhanced water supply. At least 267,868 hectares of commercial agricultural land was acquired for resettlement of landless Namibians, exceeding the target of 224, 123 hectares by 20%. 113 previously disadvantaged landless Namibians were resettled in eight regions over the last five years, while 60% of resettled farmers received support. Average production of staple food, Schletwein says, improved by 13% over the period. This will be the first strategic plan to be developed for the sector since the ministries of agriculture and land reform were merged.